We continue on the border and ABC 7 showed you last night a video shared by the Texas Department of Public Safety showing an encounter between U.S. Border Patrol agents and migrants by the Santa Teresa area. We spoke with the Sunland Park Fire Chief on how common these acts happen in that particular desert zone and ABC 7's Juarez correspondent Heriberto Perez has the story. The video shared by the Texas Department of Public Safety shows migrants trying to climb the border wall and cross illegally into the U.S. And now New Mexico authorities told me what they have responded to lately in the desert area. This is the video Texas DPS shared on social media showing migrants and alleged smugglers using a makeshift ladder to climb the border wall. You can see people throwing objects at Border Patrol agents when they arrived at the scene. One person seemed to be apprehended by a Border Patrol agent. This is the first time I've seen uh, migrants actually engaged or uh, what appears to be uh, some kind of conflict with Border Patrol. Chief Medrano also told me what they usually see in the Sunland Park and Santa Teresa areas is migrants getting injured or are climbing the border wall. They don't see that kind of conflict often. Recently, they have assisted a lot of falls from the border wall. Yesterday, they had three different incidents where migrants were injured for falling from the border wall. What was unusual uh, this past month is we did see quite a few uh, migrants that would go into the Rio Grande uh, here in the Sunland Park area. Uh, that needed assistance to come back out and, and you know, with the assistance of Border Patrol, of course. And we've had eight such rescues so far. And I also reached out to U.S. Border Patrol El Paso sector to learn more on this incident. They referred me with Texas DPS. I will show you what they told me tonight on ABC 7 at 6. Reporting in Ciudad Juarez, Heriberto Perez, ABC 7.